Welcome eager travelers to your comprehensive guide to the awe-inspiring landscapes of Vietnam. Situated at the farthest east of the Indochina Peninsula, this Southeast Asian gem encapsulates a rich past, a lively culture and spectacular natural wonders. A visit to Vietnam is akin to traversing the chapters of a living history book, its story shaped significantly by influential Chinese, French and American eras. Every location here tells a tale of resilience and courage. Yet Vietnam is not just a historical showcase. It is a nation radiating life and vibrancy, a captivating cultural mosaic made by its warm, hospitable inhabitants and an its irresistible cuisine. Its various festivals, the vibrant Lantern Festival in Hoi An or the spellbinding Dragon Dance during the Mid-Autumn Festival, vibrant showcases of its cultural wealth. Furthermore, Vietnam harmoniously blends the old and the new, offering the chaos of Hanoi city life, the peace of the Mekong Delta's rural life, and the allure of ancient towns like Hoi An. Prepare yourself as we set off on an awe-inspiring journey to Vietnam's finest spots. Sit back and allow Vietnam to unravel its wonders to you step by step, from the mystical Ha Long Bay to the intriguing Coochie Tunnels. Our first stop is the stunning Ha Long Bay. Picture a place where emerald waters meet vast skies, where limestone pillars rise majestically out of the sea shrouded by rainforest. That's Ha Long Bay for you, a dreamscape that appears to be plucked straight from a mythical tale. Nestled in the northern region of Vietnam in Quang Ninh province, Ha Long Bay is a UNESCO World Heritage Site and for good reason. The bay is a spectacular seascape sculpted by nature's own hands over millions of years. It's home to nearly 2,000 islands and islets, each a unique spectacle of rugged beauty. But it's not just about the breathtaking views. Ha Long Bay offers a plethora of activities for the curious traveller. Ever fancied kayaking through karst caves or hiking up limestone cliffs? Perhaps you'd prefer a tranquil day out, cruising on a traditional junk boat, the gentle lull of the waves beneath you while you soak in the panoramic vistas of the bay. And then there's the local culture, a vibrant tapestry woven with threads of history and tradition. Explore floating villages, meet the locals, and indulge in fresh seafood cuisine, a staple of the Bay Area. As the sun sets, watch the bay come alive with a different kind of beauty, the water shimmering under the soft glow of the moonlight. Indeed, Ha Long Bay is a must-see spectacle of natural wonder. It's not just a place, but an experience, a timeless testament to nature's grandeur waiting to be explored. If you're enjoying this video, don't forget to like, subscribe and share it with your fellow travel enthusiasts. Next, we venture into the heart of Hanoi, the serene Huan Kiem Lake. A charming oasis in the midst of the bustling city, Huan Kiem Lake is more than just a body of water. It's a symbol of Hanoi's vibrant culture and a testament to its rich history. As the epicenter of the city's social life, it's a place where locals come to enjoy the simple pleasures of life, be it an early morning Tai Chi session or a leisurely stroll at sunset. The lake's name, Huan Kiem, translates to Lake of the Returned Sword, a name steeped in an ancient legend. As the story goes, a divine turtle presented a magical sword to a king to help him fend off invaders. After the victory, the turtle reappeared, reclaiming the sword and disappearing into the lake's depths. Surrounding the lake, the vibrant old quarter teems with a blend of traditional and modern life. A visit to Hanoi is incomplete without experiencing the tranquil beauty of Huan Kiem Lake. Moving on, we find ourselves in the charming Hoi An ancient town. Nestled in the heart of Quang Nam province, Hoi An is a splendid beacon of Vietnamese history. The town, a UNESCO World Heritage Site, preserves the allure of a bygone era, with its well-preserved buildings reflecting a unique blend of local and foreign influences. Walking down the narrow, lantern-lit streets, one can't help but be enchanted by the yellow ochre houses adorned with intricate carvings and red-tiled roofs that hark back to its past as a bustling trading port. The town's architecture is a delightful mix of styles, from wooden Chinese shop houses and temples to colourful French colonial buildings, to the iconic Japanese-covered bridge with its graceful curve and ornate details. Beyond the architecture, Hoi An offers a vibrant cultural experience. Traditional arts and crafts flourish here, 
and the local cuisine is a tantalizing fusion of flavors that whispers tales of the town's rich cultural history. Hoi, an ancient town, a place where time seems to stand still. Next, we journey into the wilderness of Phong Na Ke Bang National Park. Here, nestled in the heart of Quang Bin Province, lies a spectacular haven of biodiversity and geology. Stretching out over 2,000 square kilometers, this national park is a treasure trove of unique ecosystems and geological marvels. The park is renowned for its ancient limestone cast mountains, towering high and majestic, their surfaces etched by the passage of time. This geological wonderland is home to an array of intricate caves and underground rivers, including the world's largest cave, Sondung. These subterranean landscapes are a testament to the slow, persistent power of water, carving paths through rock over millions of years. But the beauty of Phong Na Ke Bang extends beyond its rocks. The park plays host to a rich variety of flora and fauna. In the dense forests, hundreds of bird species sing their songs, while rare and endangered mammals tread softly through the undergrowth. It's a biodiversity hotspot, a living, breathing testament to the richness of life on Earth. For the adventurous souls, Phong Na Ke Bang offers a wealth of activities. From trekking through the verdant jungle to exploring the depths of its caves, each adventure allows you to immerse yourself in the park's natural beauty. Perhaps you might even kayak down its serene rivers, the cool water reflecting the emerald canopy above. Phong Na Ke Bang National Park, where nature's majesty reveals itself. Here, in the heart of Vietnam, the wilderness beckons, offering a glimpse into the Earth's past and a chance to lose yourself in the wonders of the natural world. Now we ascend to the breathtaking Sapa Terraces. Cradled in the misty highlands of Lao Cai province, the Sapa Terraces are a sight to behold. These verdant steps, etched into the mountainside, are a testament to a centuries-old agricultural tradition. They are the lifeblood of the local Hmong and Dao communities who have, generation after generation, painstakingly carved these terraces out of the sloping landscapes. The Sapa terraces are more than just a means of survival, they are a symphony of human perseverance and the raw beauty of nature. As the seasons change, so do they, transforming from the lush green of the planting season to the golden hue of harvest time. And in the early mornings when the fog rolls in, they appear as if floating amidst a sea of clouds, a spectacle that has captured the hearts of many a traveller. But the allure of Sapa extends beyond its terraces. This mountainous region is home to a tapestry of tribal cultures, each with its unique traditions and customs. The Hmong and Dao communities in particular are renowned for their exquisite textile crafts. From vibrant indigo-dyed hemp fabrics to intricately embroidered clothing, their artistry is a vibrant thread in the cultural fabric of Sapa. Visitors to the region often find themselves drawn into the rhythm of local life. Whether it's witnessing the bustling market days where tribespeople trade goods and stories, or being welcomed into a local home for a meal. These interactions, candid and heartfelt, offer a glimpse into a way of life that is as resilient as the terraces themselves. And let's not forget the simple joys of hiking through the terraces. Each bend in the trail unveils a new panorama, each vista more enchanting than the last. The symphony of rustling leaves, chirping birds, and the distant murmur of a flowing stream all combine to create an ambience of tranquility that lingers long after the journey's end. Sapa Terraces, a testament to human ingenuity and nature's splendor. Indeed, Sapa is a place where the lines between man and nature blur, where life unfolds in harmony with the rhythm of the seasons, and where the spirit of Vietnam's highlands truly comes alive. Our journey continues to the historic imperial city of Hue. As we traverse the heart of Vietnam, we find ourselves in the city of Hue, an epitome of the country's regal past. This former imperial capital is a living testament to the grandeur and sophistication of the Nguyen dynasty. Stepping into the city is like stepping back in time. The imposing city walls, ornate pagodas and majestic palaces paint a vivid portrait of a bygone era. The architecture here is a harmonious blend of traditional Vietnamese design and modern French influence, creating a unique aesthetic that is distinctly hue. But it's not just about the buildings, it's about the lifestyle they represent. 
The imperial city was once the heart of a flourishing empire, and today it continues to showcase the opulence and elegance of the royal lifestyle. From the intricate details of the emperor's residence to the serene atmosphere of the royal gardens, every corner of Hue whispers stories of its glorious past. Imperial City of Hue, a majestic walk through Vietnam's royal past. Next, we navigate the life-giving waters of the Mekong Delta. A place where life pulses with a rhythm as steady as the boats that glide along its channels, the Mekong Delta is a mesmerizing mosaic of water, land and life. This vast labyrinth of waterways spread across several provinces, including Anjiang, Dong Tap, Vinh Long and others, serves as the beating heart of Vietnam's agriculture. Indeed, it's often called the rice bowl of Vietnam, producing more than a third of the country's annual food crop. But it's not just rice that flourishes here. The Delta is a cornucopia of fruits, vegetables and aquatic life, all nurtured by the nutrient-rich sediment carried by the Mekong River. Yet agriculture is just one facet of the Mekong Delta. The Delta is also home to a unique way of life, shaped by the ebb and flow of the waters. The inhabitants, resilient and resourceful, have adapted to their watery world in remarkable ways. From floating markets bustling with activity at the break of dawn to stilt houses that rise above the water's surface, life here is inextricably tied to the river. For the intrepid traveller, the Mekong Delta offers a trove of experiences. You can paddle through mangrove forests, savour lip-smacking local cuisine, or simply sit back and watch the world go by on a river cruise. Every moment spent here is a brush with the vitality and vibrancy of Vietnam. Mekong Delta, a vibrant and vital part of Vietnam. Now, we delve into the intriguing Kuchi tunnels of Ho Chi Minh City. A labyrinth of underground passageways, the Ku Chi tunnels are a true testament to the ingenuity and resilience of the Vietnamese people during the Vietnam War. These tunnels, stretching over 250 kilometers, served as hiding spots, supply routes, hospitals and living quarters for Vietnamese fighters. Constructed with simple tools and bare hands, the tunnels represent a unique architectural marvel. Their multi-level structure, camouflaged entrances and booby traps ensured the safety of their inhabitants, confounding enemy forces. Today, these tunnels offer a unique experience for visitors. One can crawl through safe sections of the tunnels, gaining a first-hand perspective of the conditions endured by the Vietnamese fighters. A visit to the tunnels is not just a historical exploration, but an adventure that takes you back in time. Kuchi Tunnels, a stark reminder of Vietnam's resilient spirit. Finally, we ascend the mesmerizing Barna Hills and traverse the golden Muay Ne San dunes, an adventure that takes us from the heights of Da Nang to the windswept plains of Binh Thuan. A cable car ride up the Barna Hills, one of the longest in the world, makes for a thrilling start. The ride itself is a spectacle, offering panoramic views of the surrounding mountains and cityscapes. At the summit, we find a delightful blend of nature and man-made wonders. The French village, with its quaint European architecture, brings a slice of the old world to the heart of Vietnam. And let's not forget the iconic Golden Bridge, held aloft by two giant stone hands, a sight that truly stirs the soul. From there, we descend to the coastal city of Da Nang, where the marble mountains await. These five limestone and marble hills are named after the five elements. Metal, wood, water, fire and earth each one housing temples and caves that tell tales of Buddhism in Vietnam. But our journey doesn't end there. We move on to the Muina San Dunes in Phan Thiet, Binh Thuan. A stark contrast to the lush greenery and cool climbs of the Ibana Hills, these dunes offer a different kind of beauty. The vast golden sands, shaped and reshaped by the whims of the wind, create an ever-changing landscape that is a sight to behold. Whether it's watching the sunrise over the endless sand dunes, sandboarding down the slopes, or exploring the fairy stream with its red and white sandstone formations, Moine has something for every kind of adventurer. And as the sun sets, casting long shadows and painting the sands in hues of red and orange, you can't help but marvel at the raw, untouched beauty of it all. Bana Hills and Moine Sand Dunes, the perfect end to our journey through Vietnam two distinct landscapes, each with its own charm and allure, 
that encapsulate the diverse beauty of this country. From the heights of the hills to the depths of the dunes, it's a journey of contrasts, a journey of discovery, a journey that is quintessentially Vietnam. And with that, our journey comes to an end. We've sailed through the emerald waters of Ha Long Bay, wandered around the serene Huan Kiem Lake, and strolled through Hoi An's ancient streets. We've explored the vastness of Phong Nha Ke Bang National Park and the terraced landscapes of Sapa. We've delved into history at the Imperial City and Mekong Delta, braved the Kuchi Tunnels, and admired the views at Bana Hills and Muy Ne San Dunes. Vietnam, a nation where history, culture, and nature blend seamlessly into a captivating symphony. As our adventure through Vietnam comes to an end, we'd love to hear about your experiences and thoughts on this journey. Feel free to share your opinions in the comments below, and don't hesitate to suggest any further places you'd like to explore in the future. Thank you for joining us on this unforgettable tour of Vietnam. Until next time, happy travels.